I want to display some text. Let's just get rid of this. I want to display some text on the screen. Well, this takes the draw event. Draw. Now, this actually kind of works like step in the sense that it just keep on working constantly throughout its existence. But this is basically so we can see things on screen. You don't always have to use draw. If, if you're playing a character and it's got a sprite, you won't necessarily have to use the draw command. You might have to change the sprite if it's walking in a certain direction temporarily or something like that. But that's not what we're wanting to do right now. What we're wanting to do here is we are wanting to add some code. And we are wanting to display some text on the screen. Now, the way to draw text is you write draw underscore text now, and you do open and close bracket. Now, these are normal brackets. And as you can see at the bottom there, this is the variables that you're going to put into, into the drawing function. So what that means is, say, x will be the x coordinate, y will be the y coordinate, and string will be the bit of text that you actually want to put there. So say I wanted to say on the screen, hello, this is some text. So I would put in the I would put in the the x and y coordinates. Now one thing I want to say about the x and y coordinates. Say it first of all it measures from the top left corner. So say if I put in 16 comma 16 that would just put it in that part of the screen. But if you want to make it so that it always appears on that part of the screen rather than that part of the room then you have to do something else. And what I mean by that is, say if you want to have a game where you've got the screen and you want it to display how much health you have in the corner, so you draw it in the corner, like there. Right? Say, say if this represents the screen that you can see on the game and you want, that, you want your health to be displayed in the top corner there. Now, what would happen is, it would be in the corner of the room, but say if your character moves away and the, and the room scrolls across, that is going to be left behind because it's in a certain part of the room. So what you're wanting to do instead is you're wanting to do view underscore x view plus 16. And for the y corner, you want to do view underscore y view plus 16. Might be a bit to take in, but if you want to keep on the screen, then that's important. Now, the bit of text that we want it to say is... Let's make it say, hello, you are playing this game. Now, you need to use quotation marks. Hello, you are playing this game. And so, let's OK that. Save it. And this should work unless I've made some stupid mistake somewhere. Yes, there it says it. Hello, comma, you are playing this game. Not a very fun game, but still, we are playing it. Anyway, exit that. Now, one thing I want to mention with drawing is that what I've got here is that I've, re I've written a statement in quotation marks. Now, what that means is it's going to draw exactly that. Say I want it to display how much health I have. Instead of doing that, I would put in the health because that is my number to represent my health. And because this is within the, it's in the same object that has that variable. So I can say, for health, play it now. Hopefully I've not messed, well I shouldn't have, but let's see if this works. And yes, it displays 100, that's how much health I have. So yeah, there you have it. It's important to notice that one of the good things about having uh, string variables, such as weapon for a for example, if you remember, the weapon starts as a pistol, it can end. So, the weapon is pistol. Now, I'm not going to put this in quotation marks. If I put this in quotation marks, it would just literally say in the corner, the weapon. I don't want that. I want it to draw the word that is the weapon. So, this the weapon is referencing that other thing. So, let's load this. And it should say pistol in the corner. Yes, pistol, because that is the weapon 
that I own, and that is the variable that is fair weapon.